So we're going to be closing all of our summer camps effective this week. First at noon, summer camp shut down. That's just one of the steps Mommy Mayor Francis Suarez announced this morning to help slow the spread of the coronavirus. A complete shutdown, though, was not one of them. Let's get right up to CBS 4's Brooke Schaefer. She's live at City Hall in Coconut Grove with the details. Brooke. Hey, Maribel, good afternoon. Yeah, a lot to cover in the nearly 30 minute press conference this morning. Mayor Francis Suarez said he is seeing some slight improvements in cases here in his city. But still, he announced summer camps will be closing after three kids and a counselor got sick. We had um, one child infected in uh, Henderson Park, two children infected in Coral Gate Park, and one in one counselor infected in Shenandoah Park. So we're going to be closing all of our summer camps effective this week. Joining Miami-Dade County and the city of Miami Beach, summer camps in the city of Miami will now close, Miami Mayor Francis Suarez announced Tuesday morning. For the moment, the hospital administrators who are monitoring capacity as well as our specialists, our epidemiologists and our biostatisticians are telling us to maintain the course. They are seeing improvement in the uh, rate of percent positives per day and on in the rate of new cases per day. The move comes amid high coronavirus case numbers in South Florida. The mayor at this point has not issued another stay at home order for the city of Miami, though he did say it's a daily discussion. That's something we're looking at legally. Uh, we're also um, monitoring social media and I get a lot of social media uh, posts about illegal parties and things of that nature. And that's why we also have an enforcement team now that's going to be dedicated just for enforcement uh, for 39 police officers. And this week we're going to be enforcing heavily. For now, Mayor Suarez says he's focused on beefing up enforcement on people not wearing masks. The mayor even said his office is looking at something Broward County did in banning parties or gatherings of more than 10 people in homes. So folks, we must be extremely careful when we get home. If you are exposed, and you may not even know that you're exposed, when you're coming home, your family is in danger. The mayor also calling on younger people to listen to the warnings and pointed to a Department of Health study of 1,000 people, saying the largest category of people getting sick are ages 18 to 34 years old, and 32% of people are reporting getting sick in their homes. Now, the mayor also briefly touched on schools. No decision there yet, but he did mention he is concerned about schools potentially opening up in person. He said he's worried that could bring another wave of cases here in the city of Miami. But again, summer camps closing. No stay-at-home order, though, for the city of Miami. The mayor said he has met with some business owners to talk about that. He said he plans to have another discussion with business owners next Friday. I'm live in Coconut Grove. Brooke Schaefer, CBS 4 News.